Hi, uh, my name is Mike Warner. Many of you know me from uh, my activities with the Church Properties Board, or you might have seen me ushering on uh, Sunday mornings. Uh, I was fortunate that I was raised in a, a Christian home. I'm uh, second generation at Emanuel Lutheran School in Bristol. My uncle was principal. Most of my family graduated from Concordia uh, colleges and universities, so I never knew anything else. I was raised a Christian. Uh, my mom uh, always told me that uh, that Jesus is walking right beside you all the time. Just talk to him like he's your friend. You don't have to have any kind of formal prayer. You don't have to have any kind of formal discussion. Just talk to him like he's your buddy, like he's your classmate. And I've done that my whole life, and I believe that, that he's guided me uh, throughout my life, through everything I've done. Uh, one thing Ma taught me was uh, never ask for stuff for yourself. That's selfish. You should ask for stuff to help other people. You can ask the Lord to guide you through difficult situations, but don't ask for stuff. That's just not right. So I, I never did. Well, it was interesting. Uh, I usually sit toward, you know, Lutherans have assigned seats, so uh, yeah, I, was sit <laughs> I was sitting toward the back, and uh, I've got a back issue, it's a congenital problem, it's never going away, uh, but uh, that particular Sunday I was struggling to stand up, and then whoever was behind me noticed it, and Gunther, uh, it was... Uh, Janet Gunther and Andrea uh, Peterson. Peterson. So Janet said, your back is hurting you. Let me, can I pray on you? She said, nah, I'll be all right. You, you don't have to, no, please, you're coming up front. So she grabbed me on one arm. Andrea grabbed me on the other arm, and they brought me up to the altar, and they put their hands on me, and they started praying. You got to, I've never been a big believer in this stuff. <laughs> But, but they put their hands on me, and they prayed for me, and it was like, all of a sudden, the pain just went away. I, and I said, holy cow, what did you guys just do? And Janet said to me, that was the Lord. That was Jesus taking the pain away. Now, I mean, the pain still comes and goes, but at that particular time, it went away. Like, I can't even explain it. It's just gone. So thank God for them, but thank God for you guys for getting us involved in this group because they really do great work.